Cloud computing and virtualization are largely adopted in the IT world and starts to get momentum in networking to implement network functions, such as switches or routers, but also complex network service chains, such as end-to-end -end security services. Surprisingly, while robustness is the first question that comes when deploying dedicated network infrastructures, cloud infrastructure provide little or no robustness guarantees for virtualized network functions. As a matter of fact, traditional cloud infrastructure are several order of magnitude slower than dedicated network infrastructures to react to threats. In this work, we aim at providing robustness guarantees for network functions deployed with OpenStack, the leading open source product for cloud computing. Multiple options are possible to implement such robustness in OpenStack, but we design an approach that minimizes the changes required to OpenStack, such that it can be smoothly integrated with the official community. A well-documented implementation follows the best programming practices to guarantee its correctness and integration in the large open source project. This demo shows how our implementation works in an environment composed of four compute nodes. In this screen, we can see that we have four compute nodes. Let's start the demo. First, let's create an instance without robustness. This is the normal OpenStack behavior. As we can see, no instances are created yet. Let's create it. As usual, the instance is created and deployed in one compute mode. The deletion of the instance behaves as usual. Let's deploy an instance with robustness equal to zero. Robustness is activated, but as the level is zero, no additional instance has to be created. OpenStack will receive the robustness requirement via the ints in the command. As expected, one instance is created and deployed in one compute. The deletion of the instance behaves as usual. Let's now create an instance with robustness equal to 2. To guarantee a robustness to two failures, at least three instances have to be created each one on a different compute node. OpenStack receives the robustness requirement via the things. As we can see, three different instances have been created and deploy each on a different host, compute one, compute two, and compute three. Instances that are created with for business are linked together. Deleting one instance results in deleting all the instances associated together. Let's take one instance among others. The result is the deletion of all the associated instances. Finally, let's create a, uh, an instance with robustness equal to 4. To be robust to 4 failures, at least 5 instances are necessary. This is impossible in our setup as we only have 4 compute nodes. OpenStack still receives the robustness requirement via the end. As we don't have enough hosts, an exception is drawn. 